<coughs> Hi, I'm Martin Pierser, and today we try to mix house music and Brazilian funk. So let's start. So for this purpose, I want to mix some sounds from house music, classic kick, clap, 909, open hat and crash. Very, very simple. And then I try to sing something like Brazilian stuff, I like this, the tu cha cha and pitch it down. Then I have these two samples. Hoi! Hi! And hi, I don't know. Hi! <laughs> it's a sound. I want to create some short steps, house short steps. So this is uh, a patch I made, I use a lot. And for this purpose I want to make a minor 7 chord and add uh, the 9 and the 10th minor. Then I set the chord mode to accept the exact notes I, uh, I played. So it will sound like this. And if I transpose this on the lower notes, it will sound like a house tab. Yeah, something like that. So I started to make a pattern with this, with this two cha cha. The BPM is 125. So I want to copy this. Add the chords from the Ultranova, two bars. Let's try. Okay, it should be perfect in, perfect in time. Okay. <laughs> Okay, it's too long, so let's normalize the volume. Maybe put down a little bit. Like this. Okay, then on the third pattern, I want to. Let's put the drums on the bus 2. And I want to record only the kick drum and the other part of the shorts. So let's record the shorts before. It's over two bars. Let's try. So normalize and put the volume down to 80. Mm. I want to try again. Nice. So again, normalize and put the Daliova down to 80. Yeah, it's not perfectly quantized, but it's part of the Brazilian funk genre. Sounds okay for me. Let's record the drums. TRX for the kick drum. Okay, chords. Mm, I don't like it very much. Okay, let's re record this. This time should be okay, I hope. Mm, I don't like it. Maybe it's perfect this time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Hi. Oops. Mm, 
Okay, let's copy this here. And let's add the other drums. Then I want to copy this part to create a breakdown. Okay, maybe two bars long, so I'm gonna edit, duplicate, and record the crash. Okay, I forgot to add, to add the bass here. Okay. Yeah, something like this. I want to record this on this pad. Okay, I hope it's, this will be in time. Sounds fine. I want to add some percussions. Maybe I can, I can find... A loop from my SD card, some percussion loops, let's see. Yeah, something like this, I like it. 86 BPM, it's almost in time, I manually change it. Nice, so I took it to 125. Okay. Okay, the volume maybe is too loud, okay. 68, it's K. Then drop again, but this time I want to add the percussion. And then copy the second part with the percussion. Now it's time to add some vocals. I will delete this cha cha here and use the OI sample this time and increase the velocity. And use the same technique here, but this time we use the pad. Maybe it's too loud. I want to decrease the volume of this. The same here, what we can add, maybe a free or free. So, tempo under 25, and I will add some swing on it. And I will play with the cutoff filter. So, it's waiting for me to press play. Three, two, one, go. What the fuck happened? It crashes. Okay, let's try again. Go! Three, two, one, go. Okay. So this time, for sure, there is no error here. So I'll copy this here and press play, and then I will adjust the volume. Too loud! Maybe I can add a vocal of someone rapping or some in Brazilian or something like that, I don't know. Maybe I will add it in post-production. So I hope you enjoyed the video. This is the final bit.